بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم in the last lesson lesson number four we explained the out layer handling by using the filter enter quartile range then delete the tubules contain the out layers in this lesson we show the replacing process of out layer with non out layers instead of deleting the tubules the first way to replace the out layers is manually for example if we have the weather data edit button and replace the original value of humidity attribute with the new values some new values 150 and minus 100 900 200 and 120 and we need to check up if these new values are Outliers or extreme values by using the interquartile range choose and this interquartile range apply button edit so we have two outlier and extreme values one outlier is minus 100 and one extreme values is 900 so we we'll replace this two values with any measure here we have select median instead of these values the outlier and extreme values to compute the median we need to sort the data in humidity place in humidity attribute and see the data sorted ascending and compute the median between number seven and number eight the median is 86 plus 90 all divided by two the result is 88 so the median will be 88 here Now we have finished the replacing manually. But if we have a huge data set, this way is very difficult to replace the outliers and the extreme values because we don't know what are the boundary values of outliers and extreme values used in the filter. Also, the data is very big, so hard to replace all the outliers and extreme values manually. So we have to learn how the filter found the outliers and the extreme values. So go to the settings of the filter and press on more button and see the rules used in the filter to find the outliers and the extreme values. Q1 means quartile number 1 is 25 percentage quartile means that Q1 is the half point in the first half of the data set. Q3 75 percentage quartile means that is the half point in the second half of the data set. IQR interquartile range is the difference between Q1 and Q3. OF means outlier factor used here. You can change the factor. And EVF, extreme values factor. You can change the value of the extreme values factor. Okay, if we want to compute the outliers instead of the filter, you can do that manually. See here the table of the weather and the outlier here is minus 100 of humidity attribute and the extreme values is 900 of the humidity attribute okay now the first step is sorting the values of the humidity ascending then divide the data set in two halves each half contains seven elements compute q1 
Q1 is the value in 25% of the data set, which is the median of the first half in the data set. Q1 equal 70 is the median of the first half of the data set. Compared to Q3 is the value in 75% of the data set, which is the median of the second half of the data set. Q3 equal 120. Here, the interquartile range is 50, which is the difference between Q3 and Q1. 120 subtract 70 equal 50. The result of the calculations, the outliers X represent here outliers is greater than 270 and less than or equal 420 or the outlier here is greater than or equal minus 230 and less than minus 80 the extreme values x here represent the extreme values is greater than 420 or x is less than minus 230 okay now return to the data set and see here minus 100 is between minus 230 and minus 80 this is the out layer and 900 is greater than 420 is extreme values the out layer minus 100 and the extreme value 900 replaced with the median 80-80. Now, after learning the interquartile range of filter mechanism, the problem is how can I compute Q1 and Q3 for a huge data set contains more numeric attributes and more tubules? The answer of this question is the second way to replace the outliers and extreme values. Let us take the following example. Go to Wika, open file, data, and select credit G dataset. Notice that the instances here 1000 and the number of attributes are 21 with class so here we need just the numeric attribute no need to the nominal attribute so we will remove the nominal attribute from the filter remove type Notice that the numeric attributes is seven attributes. Edit Control A Select all data and copy all data. Go to Excel and paste the data here. Remove the number column, no need, and the class column. Okay, now we need to put the rules of the out layer. We need Q1, Q3, IQR. and need to compute the expressions here x represents the outlier greater than this side x greater than 
out here one and need to compute this side x less than out here 2 and O of the factor of out there and EVF the factor of extreme values okay now to compute the quartile number one equal quartile and select the range of the the set of the attribute number one duration Select the quartile number one and copy the range for press enter. Quartile number one is twelve. Here, press number one with number three, quartile number three. IQR is the difference between Q3 and Q1. Equal Q3 subtract Q1 is 12. Mute X greater than out here one, greater than this side, or factor here three and extreme value factor 6 according to settings of the filter settings equal q3 plus o of factor multiply with iqr Enter the result is 60 and to compute this side equal Q1 subtract O of factor multiply with IQR is minus 24. Compute the median of the attributes. What median best the range and close median is and here we will copy the head of the columns best here. To find Q1, Q3, IQR and other calculations for other attributes just select this and drag and drop to all columns. Now we need these columns and the median
Okay, now return back to the that set in the weaker and press undo to return the nominal attributes and compute the accuracy before replacing the data in the that set credit G the accuracy here 70.5 percentage okay now we will replace the out layers in the data in numeric attributes according to the calculations in Excel we will choose numeric cleaner okay now press on the settings of the numeric cleaner filter here duration attribute number two so set here number two and the max threshold could be this value and paste it here the main threshold and the median is the default max and default min Okay, apply the credit amount here number five could be. Max threshold and the threshold and the median max default main default. Okay, apply. And the age number thirteen max threshold eighty seven min threshold here minus eighteen according to the calculations. Here we will use the human inspection to modify this value and write here. 18 instead of minus 18. The max default 33. The min default 33. Okay. Apply. And to the other attributes. Now compute the accuracy after replacing the outliers and extreme values with the median according to the calculations used in Excel. Press 5. Start. See here, the accuracy is increased to be 72%. While with outliers and extreme values was 70.5%. I hope that you have enjoyed in this video and find the ways to replace the outliers and extreme values with that. Thank you very much.